So I'm just checking if the wind is filled in all the way to Rubber Island because the mission for today is check out the big ships mm -hmm. and then we're gonna go downwind to Rubber Island, say hi to Rubber Island and then kite all the way back to Big Bay. Uh, definitely do not try this at home, it is dangerous, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. So we're gonna try it out. Let's do this. Oh, hey. Hi, um, are you ready to get eaten by a shark? Please. Got the fancy uh, waterproof phone case. In case something goes wrong, I'm hoping the wind is going to be filled in all the way. Mr. Ryan is going to take some drone shots and he's going to join. And we're going to meet everyone at Dolphin Beach now. Nice mustache. Well, thanks, dude. The ladies nice. love it. <laughs> it is a beautiful day. The sun is shining. The weather is sweet. It has not been windy for a little bit. So I think uh, everybody that is in Cape Town, South Africa now is going to be on the water which is uh, not so nice, but I don't think there's going to be many people in Robben Island. Should I say it again, but just don't do this at home or in uh, somewhere else. No, just don't try it. I don't think you can do it. No, you can't do it at home. Don't do it at home. <laughs> Your mustache is so funny. Ready to, uh, ready to swim? Why swim? <laughs> no, yeah, don't flying. swim. Ready We're going to fly. fly. <laughs> hey, oh, hello. You ready? Scared. Scared? Yes. Are you also afraid of sharks? Sharks, yes. No, no, there's no sharks here. Don't worry. I, pa I painted a seal under his board, so uh, he's going to be fine. We're going to have a couple uh, couple rules. Rule number one is to um, not crash. Rule number two is not to lose each other. And rule number three is do not lose your board. And number four, what's, what's rule number four? Don't shit yourself. Don't shit yourself. Ryan has a really, really bad... <laughs> <laughs> Stomach bug. Yeah, that's definitely rule number four. And we got another other victim here. Avon just told me, yeah, he's scared of deep waters. Well, luckily it's not very deep there. It's just a little bit deep. There is a, a possibility of a wind line, which means there's a lot of wind and then eventually there's no more wind. And you do not want to be in the no wind zone. Hey. Ha. There we go. It's going to be a pretty good adventure. A couple guys are a little scared of sharks, but I think we will be fine. The mission is on. The wind is uh, perfect for a nine. Hopefully it's gonna be all the way filled in. Oh. But I think it will. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be so much fun. So Avon is afraid of uh, deep water. Um, it's definitely deep here. It's heel deep. It is heel deep here. Yeah. And did you know this the shark is the only shark in the world. It's so hot. Out of water, we get surprised. take some beautiful drone shots, but we have to wait for him. And I'm so far behind everyone. Looks like Kevin knew to turn back. Hey, look who's there! Mr. Ryan! Oh, Ryan! Oh, what do you think? I'm flying my drone, I'm like, yeah, they're gone. Oh. <laughs> Did you ship yourself already? Oh, yeah, we're good. We're okay, good. we're good, we're good. Okay, let's, let's go! Yeah. The back leg is definitely uh, getting a little bit sore from going uh, riding only to the left. Holy moly! That's a big ship, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that thing! 
Holy bananas, it is intimidating. Whoa. Oh, oh, that thing is crazy, man! Oh. <laughs> so scary! Holy fucking banana! Oh man, the thing echoes! It's very big. Now we're gonna head slightly downwind towards Robin Island, which is right there. I think it's about a um, 15 to 20 minute kite. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Little side story, because we're going downwind, uh, so I can tell you something interesting. Um, there are people that are swimming from Big Bay, which is over there. And they swim all the way to Robben Island and back. And some of them even go around Robben Island. Could you imagine swimming this? Oh, that's scary, Harry. We're halfway and I'm absolutely knackered. I was like wondering why we weren't going more downwind, but uh, I think I know now. I think they're gonna go to the other ship. This one's bigger. Oh, shark! Look at this! Look out! A big sunfish! Very big sunfish! Woohoo! That thing is also big! Very big! Way too big! Ah! Oh, that was killed! <laughs> Oh my god. There's like no wind. Fuck. Uh, the wind is definitely getting a little bit lighter. But maybe it's also because we're going downwind. I hope that wind hole is not going to be here. It's going to be a very far swim. I'm afraid that wind is just going to get worse. Oh no. You definitely do not want the wind to drop here. Okay, let's go back! Uh-oh! Yep, we're definitely in that wind hole! A band! A band! We're gonna go back to shore! We're almost there! And that's sometimes what happens here, like, it gets really windy towards the shore, and then all of a sudden there's a, a huge wind line where there's no wind, and I'm sure now when we go back, the wind is going to just pick up. Now we have full power of wind. We're really overpowered here again. Sometimes oh. strange how this spot works. There's wind. There's no wind. And when the wind is here, it's really strong. And when the wind is gone, it's really gone. Oh. Yeah. So we're heading back to Big Bay. We're almost there. I think it's another like kilometer. And uh, the mission has failed, unfortunately. But for very good reasons. Uh, we didn't want to take the risk uh, to end up uh, with no wind and not, and then we won't be able to get back. So we are back in the car. Yeah. And we alive. survived, we survived. Oh. <laughs> the mission was failed a little bit, but that happens sometimes. Uh, we're gonna try it again if you guys are up for it. Sure. It was definitely a super cool adventure. We saw big ships, we saw big fish, we saw strong wind, and we saw very light wind. And we made it back. And I didn't yeah. myself. And I didn't <laughs> shit himself. All right, see you next time for round number two. <laughs> always we do downwind and always Kevin have one car. So I was thinking Kevin have a car on every parking in the world. 
Like, you can't imagine one parking, imagine that? Kevin have a car. Because I, I don't know how this guy do, like this is magical. Look, look, pop off nowhere. Nobody knows. And he he has the key, but he don't want to tell us. He say always like, oh, some friend bring me. I'm not sure about that.